Uh, I was deciding to do part two on this hybrid Nissan uh, because the first one I was trying to do it and my scanner died and I'm inside the same car the car is running right now and I'm trying to record the video to show you guys how you can check the battery and uh, if you have a scanner like this you can go to this is Nissan you can find Nissan this is Nissan put automatic should we pull a second if you don't have a scanner like this there is an app uh, I forgot the name if you go to your app store and if you go to Google there's a bunch of app they can uh, they're able to check your battery blocks and uh, tell you the voltages and everything and uh, let's see if it's connected okay this is 07 Nissan Altima 2.5 okay and you need to go to HVECU pull the code current code and there's no code the check engine is on but this check engine is related with the EVAP I'm not worried about that you need to go to data display and there's a battery data and if you go to the battery data collecting the data okay you go down you see all the battery pockets this is from number one all the way to I think it has 24 I'm not mistaken okay there is an internal resistance as 0.02 ohms and this is correct all of them need to be the same you can diagnostic through the ohms resistance if it's high resistance there's a problem and uh, the voltage it need to be the same same thing you know 15.2 15.10 or something like that it, it fluctuates but it need to be around like uh, 14.9 15.9 and if it goes down it's, it's there is a problem on that block and normally it shows the numbers you can see that's that's how i found the problem when i was checking i think it was number 11 but this number when you count the block on the battery it's not matched because this is different number this is computer number that wasn't block number but uh, there is a there's some certain uh, information you can use i'm not sure how but uh, the number 11 was showing 6.9 or 7.9 and i found out this block it's cut off and the problem of uh, it's easy to the, do the diagnostic because when you find one block is cut you know because it's all all connected together and the current need to pass through all of them and if one of them doesn't work the current come and stuck in uh, the the one it doesn't work and it just it doesn't go through and that's why the battery doesn't work and uh, that's how i found it uh, i hope you find this video helpful guys and if you like it hit the thumbs up and if you have any question about the hybrid please uh, leave it on comment and i will answer it as soon as i can thank you